A massive multi-use project in West Tampa is one step closer to breaking ground. Tonight, the city and project leaders gave an update on the Rome Yard development after holding a series of community feedback meetings. As we know, the price of paradise has gone up over the years. And as ABC Action News reporter Rochelle Aline shows us, the biggest concern right now is how much these units could cost. When it comes to the proposed Rome Yard project in West Tampa, people in the area have made it clear that it must have community amenities, artwork, and an ode to local history. But above all else, they say they want affordability. How do you define affordable housing? Is it income-based? Those who, 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 are, who qualify to live in those units will not pay more than 30% of their adjusted income. In an update meeting on the development Monday, project leaders spoke about these concerns. And according to the city of Tampa, 600 of the project's 954 units will be listed as affordable. And I'm a co-lead of a group called YIMBY Tampa, which is a local chapter of YIMBY Action. I spoke to housing expert Nathan Hagen, who says he likes what he sees so far when it comes to the project. But he adds that given the current housing market, we need more projects like this and soon. We're in a crisis right now. To help address rising rents and a shortage of available spaces, Hagen says the city needs to focus on holding other developers accountable on their definitions of affordable housing. He also adds that the city needs to work to rezone more land for residential use. And he says it needs to be flexible on its rules when it comes to how many units can be built on smaller single-family lots. It excludes the possibility of people participating in their own improvement of their property. You know, they can't they can't take their land and build and go from a single family home to a, a duplex. The Rome Yard project is expected to be finished in six years. In Tampa, Rochelle Aline, ABC Action News. Meanwhile, to help address the need for more affordable housing, project leaders also announced tonight they're working with the Tampa Housing Authority on yet another housing project in the area. They say it will have 1,600 units and the focus will be affordability.